Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Halo sobat gadget digital yang smart Hari ini akan saya bahas Cara menghilangkan pop up Ketika kita tidak pernah berhasil uh, Untuk mengikuti guide saya yang sebelumnya Oke okay. I will let you know How to remove a pop up notifications Ya yeah, That uh, Our device is not certified by Google, so how to remove it? Okay, just let me know. Okay, I have uh, my device is here. Uh, Google Play Service Repair and Actions. This is an device is not Play Protect certified. Nah, jadi apa yang harus kita lakukan? What should we do? Ya, yeah, apa yang harus kita lakukan? Go to setting, ya, yeah. apps, Google, Google Play Services, uninstall. If you find like this, just deactivate and uninstall. If you uh, not see the device, the device an activation, uh, you just let it uh, uninstall, ya. Yeah just go uninstall oke okay. jadi kalau kalau kalian lihat device and activate tadi ya uninstall uninstall aja pokoknya mau lihat atau enggak pokoknya uninstall aja oke okay. then show system process you still have google service framework oke okay. never mind nggak usah khawatir biarin aja go to files ya yeah. Uh, the file already move to internal storage jadi nggak perlu pakai OTG lagi no need OTG ya sudah saya rim- se- sudah saya masukin ke internal device jadi bisa Google installation service and then install the GMS core mode one ya install number 8 install Uh, pop up still occur ya yeah, pop up still appear pop up akan tetap keluar biarin aja oke okay. nah this one never mind ya yeah. biarin aja just check device id you still have jsf id close remember close all this one close all sampai no apps sampai nggak ada no recent app ya yeah. close all biasakan usually use uh, clear all apps ya yeah. oke okay, selesai pop up still ker biarin aja pop up keluar go to setting again apps go to apps source framework and then show system file you will find google service framework kamu akan menemukan google service framework uninstall aja just uninstall ok finish go to device id you must no have device G- eh, gsf id yeah, you don't have gsf id so the pop up is never appear never come ya enggak enggak pernah keluar lagi pop up nya next go to internal storage again google install number 7 google service framework install dan oke okay. Look at your device ID. Still no GSF ID. Don't worry, nggak usah khawatir, masih nggak ada. Just close. Open Play Store. Still can access Play Store. Masih bisa akses Play Store. Oke. Okay. Go scroll, scroll, scroll. Go to Apps. Just scroll. Just scroll. Top chart. Just scroll until you find 
error notification sampai kalian menemukan error nanti refine error ya go to movie go to book if you find error then you are success ya yeah. you are success sampai kalian nemuin error berarti kalian sudah berhasil oke okay. let close again let's see the device ID oh you already have device ID if you don't have the GSF ID you may restart to get the GSF ID so how to uh, how to to know that the pop-up is a uh, uh, never appear again or never pop up never comes again Oke okay. gimana caranya sih biar kita tahu kalau pop-up itu udah enggak keluar lagi just like this no reason apps ya yeah. open the Play Store if you never see pop-up like this you are success but if you still find the notification just close ya tutup aja open again if you find again just close again open again still find you are not success and repeat once again delete Google Play service install again delay framework install again see device ID you don't have GSF ID you must wait until you get the GSF ID okay if you already get the GSF ID setelah dapat the GSF ID just close all up apps no recent apps open Play Store if you not find like this just close again repeat once more ulangi lagi still no pop up repeat once more again to make sure ya untuk meyakinkan kalau memang sudah tidak ada go to another tab oke okay. no nothing change so notification already stop so what next go to setting go to apps just type Google Google Play service uninstall deactivate and uninstall but sometime if uh, you uninstall this Google Play services the pop-up comes again if the pop-up comes again you need to back and repeat uh, from the beginning ya yeah? go to this and then install the Google Play Store service mode to the last file if you still find notification then you fail but if you enable see notification and you are success ya yeah, kalau kamu nggak nemuin notifikasi lagi berarti sukses hit done Don't open anything. Jangan buka apapun. Just push uh, power button. Ya. Yeah. Restart. And then you have finished. Kalian sudah selesai. Dan Huawei Mate 30 kalian sudah ada Google Mobile Service. Then your mobile phone already installed the Google mobile services let's see what happened when I restart the phone kita lihat apa yang terjadi ketika saya reset telepon handphonenya apakah keluar lagi let's see the device ID still have a GSF ID let's see the Google Play Store oke okay. there is no pop up ya yeah. So you can continue to download the Gmail or to 
Google Map or anything that uh, related to the Google mobile services okay let's see done no pop up come gak ada pop up lagi selesai so never give up ya enggak jangan pernah nyerah karena kuncinya the key is when you uninstall the GSM mode one and then replace the GSM mode one again then go to Google framework and install Google framework and reinstall Google framework then you must be patient to waiting the GSF ID appear if never come you can restart your uh, mate 30 pro then comes again and see the device ID how to get the GSF ID very simple just close all apps like this ya gimana caranya tutup aja semua uh, aplikasi go to play store go like this you can change this you can like this if you find error just let it go close all epic applications and then open again close again and repeat it until you have gsf id if you never get the gsf id then do restart so you must be patient okay thank you for watching terima kasih sudah menonton Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh